Hey, what's up? Jigsaw here. Do you want to learn how you can add an extra layer of security to your important folders? In this video, I will show you two different methods to lock folders on your Windows 10 or 11 computer. Let's go. First, let's start with Windows built-in encryption feature. To encrypt a file or folder, right-click on it and select Properties from the menu. Then, click the Advanced button and check the box next to Encrypt Contents to secure data. Once the file is locked this way, only the user account that encrypted it will be able to access it when logged in. Other user accounts on your PC won't be able to open it. But here's the catch. The built-in encryption tool only works on Windows Pro and Enterprise Editions. South, if you're using Windows Home Edition, I have a second, even easier method for you. I've tested a lot of security programs, but in my opinion, this is the best one yet. It uses military-grade encryption, which means your files are protected with the highest level of security, whether they're stored on your computer, USB drives, or hard drives. Encrypting files can be complicated, but this tool makes it easy even if you're not a tech expert. A paid subscription is required, but I personally think it is worth the money because I have not found anything similar that is free. You can download it for free using my link below and even get a discount on your subscription to try out all the features. Once you have installed the software, the first step is to find out where your files are located. If they're on your computer's hard drive, use the options under Local Disk to hide, lock, or protect them. For files on a USB or external hard drive, select the options under External Disk instead. If you want to control who can access your files without the right password, head to the Locking File section. Unlike hiding, locked files are still visible in your file system. On the right side, pick whether you want to lock only specific files, a folder, or an entire storage drive. After you add them, the status will instantly change to locked. Let's test it out. Whenever I try to open a locked file, it asks for a password first. So, no password, no access. That's it. If I could help you, feel free to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. If you have any questions about the video or want me to create a tutorial about another topic, leave a comment below. See you next time. Bye.